Happy January 22nd, everyone. I'm Liam, and we are playing the 2024 Quest Calendar by Sundial Games, the Leaf Riders of Renwood. Yesterday we said goodbye, for now, to Quill, and hello to a new friend, Cora Wildclaw, and her pet ladybug, Jim. Cora is a mouse blade dancer. Her real name is Cora Sagebloom, and she is the crown princess of Crown Spire City. So, while our squirrel friend Tok makes his way to the city to warn of an insect invasion, and the raccoon Thatch desperately tries to cure the tree of seasons of a sudden disease, and the porcupine quill patiently endures security at the city gates in a long line of people arriving for the Turning Leaf Festival. Let's see what Cora is up to. Okay. You sit at your bedroom window, high in Crown Spire Castle, gazing longingly outside as the bustling city prepares for the festival to celebrate the changing seasons. You plan to join them soon, but first you must answer the knock at your door. There's Cora and Jem. I don't see any hidden icons on this page. <clears throat> um, so we're going to do these in order. Talk to the person at your door. Uh, two, pay them, to <laughs> pay them to ignore you. Optional. 3A and 3B. And then we get to choose. We'll either persuade them to leave or lie to them. Um, those are both charisma rolls. Cora is strong in charisma and dexterity. Um... We looked at your stats yesterday. Pretty, uh, that's pretty normal health for the folks we've been seeing. She's got a high attack and defense, but a low damage. Just doesn't look like a combat scenario. I, I hope. <laughs> so, let's, uh, let's see. Pay them to ignore you. We have five amber. Okay, let's see. Talk to the person at your door. You open the door to find an unfamiliar guard has come with a message. She must be new since you know every guard that works for your mother in the castle. Good morning, Miss Cora, says the guard. I've been sent by Captain Flint Clawthorn. That's who a talk is um, headed to see. I've been sent by Captain Flint Clawthorn to deliver a message. You are to report to your mother at once. Your dresses for this evening's festivities are ready, and she wants you both to attend your fitting together. I do apologize for my lateness. It is my first day at the castle, and I got lost while looking for your room. I am to escort you down. This, it says, the calendar page says, could put a twig in your plan. <laughs> it will be difficult to sneak out of the castle if you don't show up when your mother is expecting. How will you deal with the guard? Okay, optional. Pay them to ignore you. Um, so do we bribe them? I don't know. I don't know Cora well enough to know what kind of choices she'd make. So let's, uh, let's roll. 50-50 chance. 1 to 10. She bribes them. 11 to 20. Not. Okay, she doesn't bribe them. Alright. That was optional. We keep our amber. Now we have to choose persuade them to leave or lie to them. Lying to them. Okay. Lying to them looks like we're going to fake that we're sick. Persuading persuading them to leave. Okay, again, I don't know. <laughs> so, okay, 1 to 10. We persuade them. Uh, 11 to 20. We pretend we're sick. 1 to 10. We persuade them. Okay. Since you're new here, <clears throat> Cora says, since you're new here, I will help you out. My mother will be busy for a while and likely wouldn't even know I was late. I need some more time to get ready myself, so you may leave and I will head down when I am done. Okay, now we do a charisma roll. Our charisma is plus two. Um, our abilities, Cora can re-roll. Oh, she can re-roll once per page. Regal Influence. Reroll any charisma roll and take the new result. 
<clears throat> okay, so d20 plus 2, and we can re-roll it. We don't, oh, 18 plus 2 is 20. Great. The guard says, very well then, I shall report on the matter and get back to my other duties. It was a pleasure meeting you. Good turning leaf to you. Gain a plus 2 bonus on your rolls on the next page. Okay, we will note that down. Plus two bonus to all rolls on January 23rd. Okay. Well, all right. Well, so that was uh, that was fun. Cora, I think, is going to be interesting. The Crown Princess. Our Cora wasn't willing to bribe or lie, so we'll keep that in mind as we go forward. We learned a little bit about Cora today, and uh, Cora got what she wanted, uh, as most princesses are wont to do, I suppose, <laughs> especially when talking to new guards. That's. I hope she doesn't get in trouble. Okay. All right. We will say goodbye for today and visit Cora and Jem tomorrow. I hope you will join us. Thanks for watching.